of years together. Really? We should celebrate. Yeah, let's do a road trip. No, yeah, that's damn regular. Let's go sailing somewhere. Road. See ya. Road. See. Road. See. Fine. Fine. And that is how it all started. Meet Kostub Khade, pro kayaker. Now, this guy comes with a Limka Book of Records seal and half a dozen medals to boot. Intense, eh? This is Shanjali Shahi, adventure junkie. Once a marketeer, she quit her job to become a full-time adventurer. What a girl! If it isn't already evident, she is Kostub's girlfriend. Lucky bugger! And remember these two were planning a trip together? Yeah. And this is what that is. A 3,300 km journey from Kutch to Kanyakumari over 100 days. Kostub on his kayak and Shanj on her cycle. It all sounds like fun, doesn't it? But what are you going to do when a rogue wave hits you? What happens when your phone dies on you? What happens when your kayak gets flooded? What do you eat on a beach you're stranded on? And wait, what if your kayak topples in the middle of the ocean? Or your chain breaks in the middle of nowhere? You see, Kostub is not the kind of guy who thinks like this. I know him. He's more of a shoot first and ask questions later kind of guy. This time though, you have missed most meticulous planner ever to walk on earth traveling with him, remember? I'm sure this is all her doing. So we're starting off Gujarat at Dwarka, mm -hmm. to launch off of the Gomti Ghat. Okay. Uh, from the Gomti we hit Okamadi, mm -hmm. which is about 22 kilometers. Mm -hmm. We've got the road kilometers here, we've huh. got the water kilometers here. Okay. Cool, I think it looks doable. Spoiler alert! Let's just say things did not go according to that plan. Hello! We've got a signing letter from uh, the Marine Police in the background saying that uh, we can launch tomorrow at uh, 7 in the morning. So we are on. Yeah. There are 40 miles to save per, per day. Yeah. 50 kilometers. Kilometers. Yeah. Yeah. The good Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. That's why yesterday I was uh, a little late in calling you. Yeah. Yeah. Right. And both sides see the lot of boulders. Lot of boulders. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I'll stay away. I'll stay like a place like yeah, one or two kilometers. That aside, plotting. We make a list of the essentials, the backup, emergency kits, yada yada yada, plot out the route, blah blah blah. You know that you can simply not plot certain things. Shanj has this uh, amazing ability that if the sun so much as touches her, she totally loses it. So here Shanj in like her prime pristine glory. Fine, it's just the sun. It's the sun that's a problem, not me then. Said you a problem. Oh, yes. Oh, these lovebirds. But some plans will go just as plotted. Good. <laughs> Thank you. Good. Are you excited? Yes, I'm excited. You are good. You are good. The most important part about the plan is to make way for unplanned moments. Given the chance, what would you really want to buy? A big sports car, a mansion, or your own personal island? I think I would for my own personal island. Bye. Today, we find ourselves at one. Our own little spot of facing view. In fact, this has got a sea facing view all over. I think that's kind of why we kayak. Because of all these crazy moments. And where possible, stick to the plan. This whole thing has a Columbus feel to it, right? Complete with locals who don't know what to make of it all. So Costa and Shant 
What is your pro tip for the adventure enthusiasts who are watching this series? I say always paddle hard. Oh, hydration. Hydration is the most important thing in any expedition. Stay hydrated always. Look for early signs of dehydration, such as the setting in of anger or exasperation or just pure frustration with how your day is going. And if you feel like that at any point of time, drink some water. Fabulous. Hope these guys noted that down. And what's happening in the next episode? We're doing a we're doing a music video. Yes, the next one is a music video.